So this is the lower end of the field. Very flooded. You coming across? Look at that. No fear of floods. <laughs> she carefully walked across it. But yeah, there's been a serious river of water coming down overnight and yesterday, and there'll be more tomorrow. You can see it's already flooding down here, being held up by this wall. It's not exi exiting the uh, field. It's been diverted. Here's the great oak with my flock. The great oak pasture. But here is where the water should be exiting. Out onto the road. And there you can see our other fields down by the river. That's the river coming up to meet us at the gate. That's how flooded it is. So very flooded. Our field over here is flooded as well. So very flooded. Oh, here comes a car. Very flooded. Yikes. Yes, yikes. No, ladies, I'm not letting you down here. Not today, anyway. You're drier in that field, anyway. So the river is over there. And it's come up into our fields. It's a manky wet day. You can see the road is a bit flooded going that way. Here it is coming out from our fields with the dogs behaving themselves and staying there. And then it's flooding down this way. But it's finding low spots going across and then there's drainage down into the lower field. These are our, what we call the inches, the floodplains. And they're called floodplains for a reason. And you can see that field is flooded over there. That's ours. This is ours. And that far one is ours on the other side of that hedgerow. As that's getting deep in flood water over there, I've got to now, you can see the flow is coming down here and it's going this way. So I want to divert this flow to over here to go out the gate. So that's gonna take a little bit of work. Not fun. Or actually it's kind of fun. It's like playing in the mud. I'll be playing in the mud. Kind of, I'll have to go and get a spade or something to try and see the leaves are doing a lot of the blocking of water. So if I drag my heel backwards, I don't have to get a tool. I might not be able to have, have to get a tool to drain the water this way. So divert it from going that way. Where the dogs are having a lovely time playing in the puddle. Which is growing and growing and growing because the wall is damming it off the road. Delicious rainwater. Okay. Digging time, dam making digging time. What you at? What you at, pups? Oh, bear, did you get stuck? <laughs> Loving playing in the wetland.
<laughs> Poor bear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're having a lovely time. It was so manky and wet yesterday. It was no fun being outside for the dogs. Anyway, I've been creating a bit of a leaf dam to slow the water there and using my heel to make more water here. And while I've been here, cars have been going back and forth. This is gonna be one that just a few minutes ago went to the left. It's gonna be a phone company car. Oh no, it's not a phone company car. Oh, well the phone company car will be coming soon because literally I'm watching cars going down that way and they turn around a few minutes later to come back because we're, the village is cut off from us. So we're flooded. The road is flooded. Anyway, I'm, I'm not helping matters by flooding the road more with uh, this, but I would prefer the wall didn't suddenly tumble over being undermined from underneath by the water. And anyway, this is going pretty much across the road and down towards the river. So I'll do some more playing in the mud, making dams and the like. Oh, here comes another car. They're gonna be coming back in a few minutes. Let's see, there they go. They'll be back in a few minutes. <laughs>